As leaders, how many of us struggle with certain unsorted issues in our professional lives? How many of us stop short of putting forth our point very, very strongly, uh, putting our foot down just because we have a preconceived image of a leader that we are living up to? This is how I should behave. This is how I shouldn't behave. This is what I should do, shouldn't do, and just all of that. And we continue doing that, continue struggling with that day in and day out, right? I quickly want to share past few weeks, there was an issue that I was dealing with, something which made me feel powerless, very, very weak. There was lack of clarity. There was a little bit of frustration, a little bit of anger too. But I just let all of that be. Because I had this whole opinion, no, the other person would feel this. Uh, people are watching me. This is how I should behave uh, because I'm a leader. But, but the bigger question is, if I do not stand up for myself, can I really stand up for my team, for the people around me? Can I really inspire anybody? Can I really uh, expect people to look up to me? So I decided, or rather I would say I realized that unless I stand up for myself, unless I take the onus of my happiness, my peace of mind, nothing will work out. And when I say taking onus, it doesn't mean uh, having the knowledge because knowing is only knowing. Doing means doing. So really getting down to taking those actions that are needed to sort the issue at hand. So this morning, I really not only wrote down, made decisions of what I want to do, but I also communicated it to the concerned people that this is what I want as a logical outcome to the issue at hand. And also that this is what I want very, very clearly. There's no returning back on this. So I put my foot down. I stopped taking myself for granted. And I realized what I'm demanding is not unreasonable. So somewhere I just made that choice. So what I want you all to consider and what the question that I want to leave you all with is which option do you want to choose? What choice do you want to make of being happy or just staying, letting it be, right? So sorting out those issues for yourself, that means going all out, doing whatever it takes or just continuing to struggle with those issues, uh, taking yourself for granted. But do remember the impacts and the, I think that is where the whole thing boils down to. So please, please share with me how do you deal with such issues at hand? Would love to hear on that. And those of you who are dealing with such issues, struggling with such issues and not really moving forward, I really want you to do that and share what happened. How was the experience? For me, I feel so much at peace now. I feel powerful and, and I just feel so proud as a leader that I stood up for myself. It is very important sometimes. Lovely, waiting to hear from you. Thank you.